After several days in the hospital, actor Jamie Foxx is reportedly recovering at home. Fox's daughter, Corinne, says that her dad has been home for several weeks now. Can I reiterate that? Several weeks now is what she said. Go ahead. Mm -hmm. And even that he played a little game of pickleball. Pickleball. Mm -hmm. What you know about that pickle, Fox? Last month, the actor was hospitalized for an undisclosed condition after experiencing a medical emergency a day prior. The Fox family is keeping Jamie's condition private, which has caused a lot of speculation online. Now, one of the comments I saw after Corinne made this post about pickleball, people were saying, what is pickleball? It's, right. it's new, but mm -hmm. it is the fastest growing yeah, it's, it's sports. Sport. Here. So we do have a little video just so you guys can get a look at what, uh, you know, Corinne is saying her dad is out, you know, playing pickleball. It looks like tennis, but it's on the same size court, but they only use a portion of a tennis okay. court. Very small, you don't have to move as much as tennis, mm -hmm. and a lot of older people are playing pickleball at first, but now everybody's mm -hmm. playing their pickleball leagues around the country. LeBron James see, bought a team, uh, or is trying Tom to. Tom Brady got yep. into it as well, and so pickleball is taking over. My my uh, frat brothers, they love pickleball. They, yeah. They want to play pickleball at our next reunion. I'm like, y'all crazy. I bet I'll beat you in pickleball. I don't, I've never played it, but that, that's just, not nice. just that was, letting you I'm know. Just, I'm pretty sure I would win like I did in basketball. You Let's not lie on Monday. Not against you. <laughs> right. Oh, you. okay. Yes. Very <laughs> not good. Not against you. I'll be <laughs> other people. Very good. Very good. I have won um, at basketball before. And again, first, we always say, because we love Jamie Foxx. Yes. Wish him the best. We want him to be okay. We look forward to his return to television. He has shows here on Fox we're excited about. Mm -hmm. um, but the eyebrow was up for a lot of people who were just wondering if he was well enough to play pickleball. It just seems that there would have been a picture of him thus far or a little video because so many celebrities, even yesterday, after he's supposed to have already been out and at yeah. home, mm -hmm. are saying, pray for Jamie Foxx. Journalists who are very respected right. are saying that they had heard, you know, that it was looking grim for a certain period of time and saying, pray for Jamie Foxx, this, you know, it's kind of touch and go, my words, paraphrasing what they were saying, but they yeah. definitely were painting the picture that they had heard recently that he was not uh, doing the best. Pickleball does not paint that picture. Not, not at all. And, you know, I always have a different take on things that are released from Hollywood. I treat tweets in any kind of social media as PR, mm -hmm. and they're trying to make sure that people stay engaged with Jamie Foxx. So my response to when she said he was playing pickleball was, on what device was he playing pickleball? Right. Because he was not physically playing to me because they would have posted him physically playing pickleball. Now, when you have something like a stroke, they do have some games that you play to keep your brain engaged. Mm. So she didn't say he was playing pickleball on a pickleball court in it with a team. Mm. She said he was playing pickleball. She may not have lied. She just wasn't specific, and that's called PR to me. Mm. Now, unless I see Jamie Foxx playing pickleball on a court with other people, then it'll say, if she said Jamie me was on the court playing with my uncle and them, and here's a picture of them playing, up until that point, there is a reason why we are not seeing Jamie Foxx. I just want to know what that reason is, and I wish him the best. And this but is, this whole PR thing is not good. This is not the same thing as just give him his privacy. He said, absolutely, we understand that. But it starts to make people ask more questions when you do a post from his page, very ominous, thanks everybody, just black and white word, mm -hmm. we don't know who wrote it. Right. Now you're saying he's been out of the hospital for weeks when outside of having seen him in the hospital myself in Atlanta, we kind of know that's not true because of updates we were getting from celebrities who were saying that they talked to him in the hospital mm. within the last week or so. So home for weeks, just got home, we don't know. Either way, we want him to be okay, but maybe you are inviting more scrutiny. speculation yes. and scrutiny. By because releasing. by now, at least like a, a thumbs up picture or if he's well enough to play pickleball. And there are some celebrities that we don't hear from for three or four months. And right. We're not begging to find out what they're doing. Right. Now, sh they keep posting these things. Mm -hmm. It's kind of in response to what people are saying. If he's going to be 
out for a minute, just let them be out for a minute and don't say anything. Right. Or, or Jeremy Renner that thing and show us him and let him talk to the camera or a thumbs up or anything that gives us more than he's playing pickleball in text. Um, that's a tough one to deal with. So yeah. I am interested to see who is, uh, what do you call it, navigating their PR for this because they're trying to keep him keep us thinking that he's going to come back and host this show and do all the finish the movie and all of these things which leads me back to your exact first thoughts again we don't know what happened but i'm thinking if there is a stroke or something that maybe affects your speech or and you have all or of these projects skills, or, right? or your motor skills and you have all these projects on the line mm -hmm. you want people to think i mean then hearing that you're playing pickleball is great because you want people to think that when when you do come back you're the same jamie not going to miss a step. Everything is great. But again, unless we see that, it just starts to make it more and more suspicious. The question I wanted to ask you, and you kind of already answered it, um, there was a little bit of a tussle online, if you will. Is this great PR or is this terrible PR? Well, here. <clears throat> because, and I asked that it's, because I thought about what you said about Will Smith, and I know yeah. you don't like talking about the slap, no, no, no. but just the way they hugged after and how, right. how they curated his career. Absolutely. I, I don't think this is the best PR for Jamie Foxx, unless he is good and he comes right back and doesn't miss a step. Then it's great PR because then it was the big mystery okay. and he's fine and we're all happy. Yes. But if he comes back and he's not, then they're gonna have to tell us at some point. Quick example, Sinbad, great comedian from Bent Harbor, mm -hmm. went through a health issue as well. He was out of meet, you know, uh, social media for a minute, then his family posted him rehabbing. Mm -hmm. That's how you do it, just let it be what it is. Yeah. Thoughts and prayers, and then, then let him go ahead and heal, and then give us a progress report. That's good PR to me, but we'll see.